Uh, thanks so much, April 619 our time now 620 and we do have a beautiful morning about to get underway, at least weather wise though. Look at the bright colors out there behind the city this morning. Mark Camp with a link for camera over at Tulane University and we are starting our morning here off talking about the heat record heat today. The record is 97 set back in 2000. I think we can at least tie if not break that today. Heat advisory in effects later this morning through this evening and then a feel like temperatures could be about 105 to 109 for the day today. Right now though, it's 78 degrees feels like 81. Not too bad out there. 73 degrees for you up in the Slidell area. Our cool spot is Hammond now at 70 degrees. Lake Front Airport, the hot spot coming in at 84 and 80s down along the coastline. Farther to the north in the lower 70s, Jackson, Natchez, Alexandria all at 70 degrees. Heading to Dallas, they're at 76 this morning in Houston at 75. It does feel about the same there. Lake Charles about 76 and we feel like 81 the hot spot here this morning and it does feel as hot as 90 at Lake Front Airport and 96 over in the Port Fouchon area. High temperatures today. Well, well, look at this 98 degrees in Kenner that would break the record of 97 97 in Slidell, Hammond, Macomb area, Baton Rouge area as well. Some places in the North Shore possibly could touch that 100 degree mark, so it will be a scorcher today. The heat advisory is in effect from 10 a.m. until 7 p.m. with the heat index expected to get to about 105 to 109 for the day today. The exception is the coastal area of Louisiana, but the Mississippi Gulf Coast going to be pretty toasty out there, so take it easy. Keep yourself hydrated out there and take frequent breaks if you're going to be outdoors for you coffee lovers. Yeah, that ice latte, that velvet ice, the cold brew coffee tasting pretty good when it's this hot and humid across the area and the ridge of high pressure. That's why we're so hot drying down some northerly winds that combine actually with Dorian here off the coast of South Carolina, helping to draw even more dry conditions and we're just baking as you'll see those temperatures climbing up there to 93 at lunchtime today, mid to upper 90s by three o'clock this afternoon. Even by dinner time tonight, we still feel like 92 degrees here in the city by tomorrow morning morning will be in the mid 70s on the North Shore, upper 70s in the city and then heating back up to the mid and upper 90s again for our Friday. As for Dorian, you can see here Windsor 115 moving north at 7. If you watch, it kind of looks like it's trying to make a jog here to the northeast toward the end. Hopefully that's the motion we continue to see with the new update coming in at 7 a.m. Forecast to be on that northeasterly motion this afternoon. Not too far from Myrtle Beach heading just south of Wilmington or making landfall nearby there over the outer banks of North Carolina on Friday. As as it continues to head out to sea. So this one is definitely going to looks like impact the greatest here in South Carolina and North Carolina after it spared Florida, but we're not being spared of anything. Just the heat, which is crazy. A 98 degrees, a record high today. Same for Friday, Saturday, Sunday in the upper 90s. A little bit of some rain may return later next week.